there was some kind of tug of war around here. There's a tug of war around here among the leadership here. Some people trying to push Makabou aside and they say, no, Makabou is the chairman. And they told me, don't worry. We we'll sort these things out. We we'll make sure that we recruit members of our party. And once this is done, the election is going to be held properly. But I am still the chairman of the, the Migori uh, uh, County ODM. We have had time as a party of our challenges. We have serious challenges all over the place. Some chairmen have defected to go to other parties. But Makabongo knows very well how to detect somebody who is wavering. Come and tell me, Barani, go to the Fundariyo. My go to the Fundariyo. My one guitar. My one guitar, I'm not going to be a problem. Makabongo knows them very well. We make you a better thing. And when we order Makabongo, I'm not going to take you. I'm not going to take you. Fitting center that he richly deserves. <laughs> now we are living in difficult times. There are serious challenges that we are facing as a people, as a country. We are facing these challenges, but these challenges are solvable. We are dealing with a regime that has gone rogue. You know, it took us a long time to come up with this constitution. The struggle to get a new constitution was not an easy one. We lost people in the process. For example, the people who did not want to hear the word devolution, and you know that we lost the Mumbai with the chairman of the Revolution Committee at Mumas of King. Eventually the Revolution of King, but the same same forces who are fighting against the Revolution are right at it right now, trying to undermine the Revolution. It was a team that is busy coming up, drafting amendments to various acts of Parliament, whose aim is to try to claw back on powers that have been given to the, 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 the county government constitutionally. So many of these acts are being drafted somewhere and because they have already taken parliament captain, they are being passed in parliament without any amendments. When we were in, the, in, in parliament, debate on a bill did not have any time limitation. And you could talk on a bill for an hour, for two hours, for a day. So long as you don't repeat yourself, nobody will stop you. These days they bring three bills to be passed in one afternoon. And the speakers are the ones who are doing it. They say debate today, a member is going to be allowed only three minutes. What can we discuss in three minutes? Is it with a bill with 60 crosses or 100 crosses and we're being told three minutes? Why? Well, because they want to change this country and take us back to where we come from. Through Parliament. The same way Bonge in the Hasiwa. Bonge says Hakuna Makende. And that's what has happened. So they are trying to take powers. Under the constitution, there is no provision for a provincial administration as a county commissioner, as a regional commissioner. There is no provision. The executive power in a county rests with the governor. The governor is the executive authority in the county. The so-called regional commissioner is still supposed to be 
the basically coordinating works of the national government at the county level. But you cannot command the governor. You cannot come and interfere with the function which has been you know, officially and legally held like a funeral. We must go to court and say that this, the, the current structure of county commissioners and, 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 and the regional commissioners is unconstitutional. It undermines the spirit of the current constitution. And then you've seen someone saying that I will disregard court orders. That is a language you understand very well. Who are you to disregard court orders? We went to court, to Supreme Court, to challenge the election of the presidency. And the court ruled against us in spite of all the evidence that we put before that court. They came and rubbished everything. Hearsay. Rubbish and so on. That's what he said. He said we don't agree with this ruling. But we respect the courts because they have got the constitutional right to do so. You are yourself a product of the ruling of that court and you are saying that you are going to disregard or disrespect the ruling of that court. We will not allow you to do it. Everybody must be subject to the courts. And you can see the orchestrated campaign to intimidate and blackmail the courts. You want to tell the judges and the magistrates not to be cowed. Tell them that we, together with the millions and millions of Kenyans, are behind you and will defend you. We will defend you. If you take a one million man march into Nairobi, we will do it in defense of the Constitution and the judiciary. So we we'll say here today, as we say goodbye to Makabungu, that we are here as a people of Kenya, and we are together, and we will stand together as a people of Kenya behind the judiciary. You feel what? You feel what? Wakuma Makabungu. Wakuma Makabungu Baga Boto, King Wola, Pinjangi Birthday. Pemaka Bongo, you are Hawi. He can volunteer in the middle of the voting. What are you voting? We will look at the teacher of Malay, because you have someone in the teacher. Sani, you can also go to the manager, she will tell the Moroccan cooperatives to kill the women with holding tax with five percent. You will not be here to go to the military from a bear, because I was going to be Makanaka. What will you learn from a bear? I'm saying that we are going to release a comprehensive statement on the financial outlook in this country and the proposed measures by the government and what position should be taken, what we will take ourselves as a people, as Kenyans. We will release that statement next week. You will not be able to go to Kalina before. When you say, you know what, you will come on. Come on, team. You can go to your team. Tell me what I show. I'm going to go to your team. You will not go to your team. You will not go to your team. You will drive a car. You will not drive a car. You will take a car. Kijande, Jiba Mimi, Ronje Chama. Mr. Bina Dona, our Kenya Kenya Kari, Kijana Ma, Tegu Na Hinya Kano, Ma Wood Migori, Ma Wood Doriyano, Ma Niju Met Mohamed. Enna Kanyo, Ma Wood Doriyano, 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 you know what I'm saying? I'm going to go to the Commonwealth Inspector General, my police. I'm going to go to the Commonwealth Inspector General. I'm going to go to the Commonwealth Inspector General. 
Kami kerajaan ini bukan bawang ini, ini kerajaan ini ini mahu ini terima. Kami dia nak kerja wajib, mesti ramad ini kuja. Mesti ramog. Mesti nak kerja wajib itu. Asimilah dia nak kerja wajib yang kau. Kini ini masira. Mesti dia nak kerja simbo. Ini mesti tombol ya. Okey, mesti ambo. Ini mesti untuk dua tu mesti ini kuja. Ini bubar, ini dikawui, ini dikawui, ini dikawui. Yeru kau mana ini? Eh, ajan, ani tiap opa pernah ke? Di mawar binti madam di negeri Moro, kami family, menuju ke negara ini. Siu bima matin mengalak kami pandi, untuk kita. Ocha.